Alright, yo peoples, we are back. We've helped these people out as much as we can. We got some skills in the progress. Demolition expert, it'll help with those explodey bits. So now, let's head down and see who else needs help. Not much fuel left. Okay, there's nothing for trying to do that challenge again. There's a crawl space underneath the house. Is that something I can go to? Alright, so those guys at the tower, they didn't need anything else from me, but I wonder about the chick at the house. There's much to do. And not enough of us left. What can I do for you? We need food and shelter for those that can't fight. We'll make emergency rations from dried boar and mushrooms. It's better than it sounds. But I don't think I'll be able to gather nearly enough. If you could track and kill a Razorback, as well as bring the rest of the ingredients, we might be able to keep everyone fed. For another day at least. Yes, of course. I'll be here. And thank you. Alright, so I got plenty of mushrooms, but now I gotta gather me some boar meat. That happens to be over there. Alright, this ought to be the one I need. Okay, we got everything. I need skins in order to make these ammo upgrades. I need plenty of them. So I'm sorry, piggies, but you must go. For the greater good and the greater good of me. I simply must have all your hides. How goes the hunt? Will these do? Yes. Yes. I'll start drying the meat, but this... This should be enough for now. Thank you again, Laura. Glad I could help. New gear, Huntress outfit, and 3,000 credits earned. Alright, so is that it for all her missions and stuff? So that way I can continue on with the story. I know I was helping all these people out a lot.
Actually, you know what? That mountain lion has it coming. Where you at? I know you ain't got me crouched just for the sake of it. Got you in the neck. In the neck. Wait, this is a mountain lion, ain't it? Looks like it, but the tail. The tail is completely different than what I was expecting. Oh, well. Let's meet up with Jacob and see what we can do. I need to make... I need to constantly take down animals... So I can always have skins to make. Because these ammo upgrades. Ammo uh, capacity upgrades. They require a lot of skins. So I got to make sure I'm getting plenty of skins from all these animals that I'm taking out. In order for me to be able to craft it. And I don't even need to charge up my bow because it has that much damage on it. I just need to shoot it once and there you go. Okay, we got two extra skins. I am so glad, once again, I know I said this already, but I am so glad that I got that skill that lets me get twice as many, that get lets me gather more, more resources. It is legit super useful. But Jacob's over there, and it looks like there's a letter up here. Let's read it and then move on to him. Young ones, you scoffed at learning your letters. Said it had nothing to do with hunting. But that's your first lesson. Everything is connected. And I am always right. You clever students who saw the folly and stubbornness and can read this, here's your first assignment. Track, hunt, and bring me back the pelt of one of the small creatures of the valley. Hairs you can find anywhere, night or day. Both the little brown ones in our valley and the snow hares in the peaks. The squirrels stick to the trees and rain will drive them into their burrows. And if you see fit to seek the rats, look inside the ruins or anywhere the dead still lie. Please do not bring me a rat. Oh, our Greek is almost at level three. Is that the maximum level for Greek? if I cut this rope oh it's a challenge ah so I got to cut down all the rabbits that are around here more challenges oh yeah yeah this is gonna be fun is that another campfire over there they were speech like come from the air Jacob is assembling fighters in the upper village to draw their attention there. The children and those too old to fight will be safely hidden in the Acropolis catacombs. I will go there once things are in hand here. You said they were heavily armed. How can we expect to beat them? The fight will not be won in open combat. They will hit us hard and fast, and we will take losses. They hope to crush us in their initial assault, but we will turn their eagerness into our advantage. This will be a long engagement. If we hope to survive, we must wear them down slowly, strategically. We will bleed them from a hundred cuts until they have nothing left. 
Only then will we be victorious. For now, we light the fires, warn the others in the valley. Today, we win by surviving. Gather as much ammunition and supplies as you can. Hide them in the caves and ruins. When you've completed your duties, rendezvous in the upper village. Understood? Yes! Understood! Good. Now go. The Prophet be with you. Greetings. Hello. Hello there. Hello there. These new arrowheads seem blunt. A blunt arrow is better than none. We don't know what armor these invaders wear. I'm not sure these will be enough to cut through. At least we have a few rifles this time. Oh, sweet. New base camp. Let us rest. I think we have enough skins where we can upgrade a piece of equipment. We do. That's the reason why that little uh, exclamation point is there. That's down to me. I led them here. Again, isn't it? People are suffering because of my actions. No, no, you can't think like this, Lara, or you really will drive yourself crazy. Trinity would have found this place sooner or later. At least I have the chance to help stop them of getting to the divine source first and using it to benefit the world rather than cause more pain and suffering. But is getting the divine source and bringing it to the rest of the world the best course of action? Lost. Just keep moving. That is the question. Do you think you're making the world a better place by bringing something that has been hidden from the world for so many millennia? Do you think it's a good idea? I don't think Laura fully understands the repercussions of what will happen if you bring such a powerful thing to the world. People are going to want to use it for their own personal gain. It always happens. There is always some individual that thinks that even though some people will see the benefit of it, there will, some, there will be some who see the exploitive means of it. I mean, Trinity is literally Lorecroft's version of Abstergo. Yet she's so blinded by ambition and the fulfillment of her father's legacy that she just cannot see what this will do to the world. Like, think about it. If you were to bring an object... Dang it. If you were to bring such a powerful object to the world where you could cure people of disease or even make people immortal, you risk upsetting the balance of the world. By which I mean, by making people immortal, there will be those that figure that they deserve to be immortal more than others. People will kill each other in order to be immortal or be given the chance to be immortal. And if it falls into the wrong hands, then those people will decide who get to be immortal or not. And those who, do, who are either chosen or destined, like Trinity, who think they're destined to have that power, will only have it for themselves while they allow other people to die off. And if their ambition is strong enough, then they can make it so they can make themselves immortal and just literally start killing other people in order to rid the worlds of those who are not worthy. You see the problem here? There are people who could use it for good and use it for evil. As long as there's those two types of people, it does not need to be in the world. Because that is just going to breed even more war. I mean, why do you think... Why do you think the natives is, exist, Laura? They exist because of that reason. But no, Laura sees what it could do for mankind, rather what it would do to mankind. It would splinter it. I know I'm going off on a complete tangent here, but just think about it. If you were... 
<sighs> I've already said it. I don't need to say any more. But I think uh, Alan Grant said it from Jurassic Park 3. Some of the worst ideas are done have been... Some of the worst ideas imaginable have been made with the best intentions. I think I might be paraphrasing. I think I might be getting that completely wrong. Dang it. Mulligan. But yeah, I don't think Laura fully understands what would happen to the world if she brings it back. This is a bad idea through and through. <sighs> Are this you is sure this pine resin will burn? You should have seen the last batch. Once it caught, you couldn't put it out. Even if it won't, the smell alone would be enough to drive them away. Greetings. Hello. I think I got enough. Should be able to upgrade my bow quiver now. There we go. Next up on the list. We're going to go down the list. All the way over. So now we're going to need 20 in order to increase my resource carrying capacity. But now my bow has more space. Wait, can I upgrade something else? Oh, snap! Rifle ammo! But I said we're going down to the list. Even though I probably should have been doing that from the get-go. Lara, I could use your help. Our people are spread thin across the valley. If you light the signal tower, they'll know that the danger is imminent. I'll do what I can. Once the fire is lit, they'll know what to do. Alright, light the signal fire on the spire! Middle Earth must know that the orcs are attacking. Oh, I gotta climb up there. Ally mission? Who here? Who need my help? Who need my help? I am willing to help you. Do you need help? No, she don't need help. Where is the peoples that need my help? We're on completely full on arrows. Do you need help? You're the one that came with Jacob. I have something to ask of you. Yes! What you need help. With? Jacob told me you've got a knack for exploring. There are more old places, tombs, all around the valley. You may have seen the wards placed there to frighten children. It's not superstition. Those places are dangerous, but they also hold relics of our former glory. Not just trinkets, but knowledge. I believe we need that wisdom now more than ever. A decade ago, I'd have gone myself, but now I could use your skills. Byzantine coins, Sacra Umbra outfit. The scouts tell me you've already been inside one of the old tombs. Would you share what you've learned with us? Of course. They belong to your people. We don't have much, but I have these old coins. If gold has value to you, I can give you some for every secret you find. Is she no longer speaking? Okay, so this is the lady we come to when we discover so much. The followers of the Prophet fled, but they were attacked in Syria. Greek level three! But... Okay, so I'm gonna have to go through eight more challenge tombs in order for me to complete that side mission, which is probably something I'm going to have to do later on my own time. 
But I'll probably do it on screen so I can show you guys. I mean, I want to show you what goes on. And with every tomb that I go to, there's always secret knowledge that it gives me that will probably help me out later in these fights. So maybe I'll make a separate video where I just go through hidden, uh, hidden challenge tombs or something. Like that. For a split second, I almost forgot to press the square button because I thought I could automatically grab onto it. You are not an assassin from the Assassin's Creed universe, therefore you cannot grab onto anything. But right now, let's focus on story. This place is falling apart at the seams. Fire arrows? Take it. Oh boy. Light the fires of Gondor! Master the Rohim! That should give them time to evacuate. Meet me in the upper village. I'm gathering our forces here. All right. You take the high road, and I'll take the low road. Then I'll be in Scotland before ye. Submachine gun part. One more for a submachine gun. Welcome back. I have, but I don't think I found all of them yet. All right, now we got to go up there. Oh, there's so many places to explore. Oh, the places you'll go. Monolith. Ooh, do I know enough Greek to read? Some sort of marker. Byzantine script, but I can't quite make it out. Oh, I thought my Greek only went up to a certain level. It needs to be level seven in order for me to read this. How much Greek is there in this world? I mean, sure, surely there's enough for her to, you know, read the monolith, obviously, but still, a lot of Greek. Greetings. Hello there. 
Jacob. Helicopters are headed your way. Get here as fast as you can. You gonna let me sprint? Gotta move. Time to kill. We must protect everyone. It's all I need to take out half of your soldiers. Where is the divine source? Tell me. Stop. Don't hurt anyone else. Where is it? Wait! Wait! There's a map. The Atlas. It will show you the way. Okay. Tell me about this Atlas. Hey. Atlas say uh, hey, the Atlas uh Ooh, pump action shotgun! Woohoo! Time to go hunting, boys! You've done a very dangerous thing giving me this shotgun. Oh, on the fire. Woo! I cannot wait. I cannot wait. Y'all done a very dangerous thing. What have y'all done to me right now? Hello. Goodbye. This shotgun's about the best thing you could have ever given me, I'll tell you what. Bobby, this is how you use the shotgun. You can't hide from me. None of you can hide from me. You thought that wasn't going to be met with deadly force. No, it was Superbeard. Superbeard was cool. Stand back. This is mine. I will burn this whole place down. Take more than that. bad fire bad and i'm gonna assume that all the corpses that i could have looted are now gone <laughs> Why does no one, especially enemies, ever ri <sighs> Boy. Why does no one ever see the danger of using a flamethrower? People will shoot you in the back first. We've been overrun by the natives. Croft is with them. Several casualties. Men are dead and scattered. We should have killed her. You have nothing to show for your efforts. Perhaps she'll succeed where you're failing. I will not fail. Trinity will step in if you do. And you know what that means? I'm expendable. They have no interest in my survival. I need the power of the source. <laughs> Will have it. Don't lose faith, Anna. This is God's will. Our success is inevitable. Please, just find it. My time is running out.
endured so much. These final barriers you have set before me. These sins you have forced me to commit. They must have a purpose. Only you can show me the way. Grant me strength to continue for her. For you. For Trinity. That's what you got out of that? <laughs> Your hands start bleeding, you automatically think you need to shed some blood? People don't deserve this. It is our chosen path. Our duty. It's never been easy. I understand what it's like to lose people. Trinity won't stop, will they? I doubt it. They have many resources. And the Atlas. It's an ancient map to the old city. The Trinity won't find it at that tower. Many of my people live in those ruins. They won't be prepared for what's coming. I can help them, Jacob. Will you do this for us? Or for that which you seek? Right now, they're one and the same. I'll be back with reinforcements after I've tended to the wounded. Shape, Jacob. The attack left us in shambles, and we have no one to send to the Acropolis. I know. I'll see to the wounded here. We have to get them to someplace safe. When that's done, we gather anyone still able to take the fight. Sophia will hold them off until the wounded arrive. I don't think I deserve this. Look, there's things for me to pick up in the area where I fought that flamethrower dude. They could, it would have been nice if I could have actually picked up something from him instead of it automatically going to a cutscene. But beggars can't be choosers, I suppose. Ooh, you gave me the all. I wonder what would have happened if I used the fire arrow on his backpack instead of regular buckshots. But hey, we got four weapons. Sitting pretty. Alright, there's not much else here for me. Alright, let's continue on. Here we go. I love backtracking. Well, not in every game. The game has to be reasonable with its backtracking. But when it's done like this, like Tomb Raider, I don't mind it. If it's done just to annoy me, then I don't like it. Is there anything you need? We'll live. Lord is your guardian, your protective shade at your right hand. The sun shall not harm you by day, nor moon by night. The Lord guard your soul from all evil. The Lord guard. He's stuck in perpetual prayer motioning. Now, to all time. I can't see. 
What are you saying? I have to cut it off. I'm sorry. No! No, you can't! You're not taking my leg! You will not! I'm no help if I can't fight! Then you will die, do you hear me? Your leg will rot and it will kill you. Do you want that? Don't take my leg. Please. I won't let you. People are always suffering because I want to learn stuff. <sighs> Rifle unlocked. I didn't think I was gonna actually gonna get that squirrel. But hey, at least I got it. And I see a satchel! What secrets do you hold for me? Secrets revealed! And a new campfire. Did we earn any new skills? I wish you could see the view from my tent, Lara. The dig looks so beautiful in the early evening, when the last embers of the sunlight dying upon a good day's work. Then, one by one, the fires are lit, and the smell of roasting meat wafts across the camp. They tell me that it's guinea pig. I decline it. Roth ate too. Maybe next time I'll bring you out here too. How did your history test go? Those were my happiest memories, Dad, being out on the digs with you. Especially when you gave me my own little plot to excavate. I liked that. Feeling that I was part of something important. I aced that test, by the way. What would be best? I like doing headshots. We might go with that headshot indicator. Let's go with the dead eye. And we also got a weapon as well. We'll check that out real quick. Then continue. Oh, we can upgrade our inventory as well. Still upgrade with the rifle pouch. Need to work towards that rucksack. Upgrade for Death Breath Draw Speed. Thank you. Uh, all these lovely upgrades for my weapons. But the ones I'm using right now do just fine. So, let's move on. Oh, a monolith. Do I need level 7? Seems to be a map. Yeah, I need level 4. The words. Still a ways off. I know that's overkill. Where'd it go? Ooh, little buddy. Where did you go? I cannot see you. Probably should have aimed for the... For land. Oh, well. And I need to go up there.
Note to self, do not use heavy weaponry to take out small creatures. They will instantly explode. Little tip for later. Let's stick with the bow. The bow has been good to me. The Acropolis. Is this where some of them used to live? Jacob, it's a mess up here. There's no sign of your people. Sophia might have taken them into the catacombs beneath the tower. But I've lost contact with her. All right, I'll look for her there. We're almost done evacuating the wounded here. I'll join you soon. Oh, you guys don't know how glad I am to be done with my business courses and I'm on my summer break now. <laughs> Means a lot less focus on me trying to balance both my school, my personal life, and my job. It made things quite easy for me. You know what, I wonder if I'll ever run into that Byzantine coin dude. Helicopters. I'm not too late. Should have brought more. I've learned of new ways to take you guys out, and if you see me, I just aim for your face. It will hurt. Just so you know. Ammo pickup? Can't pick it up. Ooh, but there's an arrow pickup. Thank you. Let's gather around the campfire. I want answers, but what choice do I have now? I can't let Trinity wipe these people out. There are lines here that I crossed a long time ago, and there's no going back. I've got to help them. It's clear that Jacob's people would die for him, and he for them. That kind of loyalty is rare. And to find it here, at the ends of the earth, is truly remarkable. If I fight with them, perhaps Jacob will trust me enough to tell me what's really going on. Don't let that be your only reason for helping them, Laura. Don't let that be your deciding factor on what you do. Do it because your heart says so. Not because your mind is thirsty for knowledge. God, no. Oh no, they done got the peoples. The creatures of this valley were unfamiliar to us once. But now they are our brothers and sisters as much as any relative of blood. You can learn much about the creatures of our valley from the hunters, but they find worth in death. 
We must also find the gifts our brothers give while they are still alive. In the nests of birds, you'll find feathers, the fletches to craft arrows. Ask for what you need, and the valley will provide. Sweet upgrade. The outer districts. The last of the wooden buildings will be consumed by nightfall. The heart of our city is gone, buried beneath the ice. I can take some small solace in the fact that the Mongol invaders were killed, alongside the Prophet's warriors who died to save us. And the Prophet himself? No one has seen him since the morning after the siege ended. We need his wisdom. Now more than ever, we do not have enough food to feed those who survived. Some believe the worst is over, but I fear that is not the case. All right, so we got more experience once again. Let's go to that campfire and get another upgrade. Before we move on to killing all these soldiers that are lurking in this village unwanted. You are unwanted here, sirs! No one asked you if you wanted to be here. Huh. Body trap specialists. On the rare chance that their bodies are left out in the open, let's booby trap them. And they'll get taken out without alerting people that are near them. I want to see how this works. Sorry if I ran across your table. Got all this ore. All these secrets. It's a reliquary box. Something used to protect and hold relics of the saints. Anything from teeth to fingers to the entire head, this claims to be a relic of the prophet. <sighs> it's empty. What did you expect to see a person's tooth or a finger in there? That's nasty. And I got all I need. Let's move on. We got soldiers to kill. Take them out. Don't shoot. one. Be more thorough going forward. What's our status? Looks all clear here. Team 4 is searching the tunnels for any sign of the Atlas. Spread out to sweep the area. Kill anything still moving. And use your knives if you can. We need to conserve ammo. Alright, the big one is going to probably be the priority. Because if this breaks out into a firefight, I do not want him on me. He causes the most damage. I wonder, I'm looking around at my options here. Oh, 
Molotov. Target acquired. Gotta try a different approach. Take him out. Don't shoot. <laughs> Spread out to sweep the area. Kill anything still moving. And use your knives if you can. We need to conserve ammo. Three at once! Come on, come on! Three at once! How you gonna let me take out three people at the same time? Investigate the body. Molotov, Molotov, Molotov. That was easier than I expected. Could have gone the other way if they'd been ready for it. Just stay sharp. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing here.
All right, let's go pillage the bodies of the dudes we just took out. No sense in me wasting all of my good materials. Trying to kill you. We got a letter over there. We'll check on that. First, we got to get this guy that we burnt to a crisp. Thank you. Oh, more skins. Yay, more skins. All right, now we can move on. You have horrible aim if you couldn't even hit me from that distance. Wait for it. Ding! Winner, winner, chicken dinner! If only I could have got here sooner, I might have been able to save them. Materials? We gotta get them. I seen something over here. What is this? What is this? Mushrooms. Pleasure mushrooms. Ah! Oh, damn it. <sighs> hey, hey, hold up. These bastards are resourceful. They might have set up some traps. Don't worry. I'll kill anything that moves. Just take it slow. Stay sharp. No, I'm not trying to go through there. I won't tell you anything. See, I believe you. That's why we're just going to beat you until you stop breathing. That way, when I ask you next time, you act as if you'll know. You made your point. If it makes you uncomfortable, spin around and face the wall. I have to admit, I prefer this. Questions just get in the way. Bastards. 
Untie me. I'll kill every last one of them. Easy, Sophia. So much bloodshed. We're losing too many people. Maybe your people have sacrificed enough. It's... All we've known. I misjudged you, Lara. Tell me how I can help you. I've got to get the rest to safety. But the entrance to the catacombs is blocked. I'll find a way to clear it. You're gonna be okay. Why won't you let me loot the bodies? Just help us get the others to safety. Every time a cutscene happens, the bodies disappear and I cannot loot. We'll get through the safe. Just hold on. You deny me my loot? It'll be over. It's barred from the other side. Maybe I can unblock it from here. The catacombs. We'll be safe there. Hmm. Some kind of armory. Ooh. What you got, Laura? Hmm. This should do it. Oh, explosive arrows? Are those... Are those explosive arrow rounds? Ooh, I know her so well. Grenades! An ancient deer charm carved from a stag's antler. It could have been an important object or a child's toy. Alright, there's nothing else for me to pick up here. Explosive rounds! Get clear of the door! Hot one coming in! Thank you, Laura. They'll be safe in the catacombs for now. I know you seek the Divine Source, but my people will die to protect it. Your people are already dying. You can't protect it forever. We've lasted this long. But for now, I'm glad to have you as an ally. They're converging on the tower. We still got people there. Get the others to safety. They'll need you. base camp. Where? Is it up here? Did we unlock some new skills? Like, there's secret ways to go in and out of this place. Okay, so the way I'm supposed to go is around there. So we need to go ahead and rest up real quick. Resting. And inventory is probably going to be the same thing. Yep, bullets. Uh, let me just go ahead and do this so it can stop appearing in my inventory. Craftswoman. Sweet! Oh, thank you, trophy. Now I can hold more bullets. Hold more 
more shotgun ammo. So I have an assault rifle, an SMG, and a golden fang bolt action rifle. Maybe I should get some, uh... Maybe I should get some weapons that are actually fast for me to use. That way I can stun lock people. I mean, I'm just saying it's an option. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is where we're going to end it for today. Hope you have a fantastic day. I can't wait to see you all in the next video. So once again, as always, later, peoples.